video I have not uploaded on this channel in a very long time and I've truly missed creating content and showing you guys how to do your hair so today I'm back with another video to show you guys how to trim your natural hair at home by yourself so if you guys want to see how I do it make sure to keep on watching and if you haven't already subscribed to my channel make sure to hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video and don't forget to turn on my post notification bell to get notified every single time I post. I post two times a week on Tuesdays and Fridays so you don't want to miss a video. Also don't forget to like this video, leave down any video suggestions you may have down below, follow my Instagram, my Snapchat, my Twitter, and my TikTok to keep up with me and without further ado, let's get into the video. Alright everyone, to start off, I will be sectioning my hair into two sections and I will put the other section away with a ponytail holder and I will focus on this section. So pretty much what I'm going to be doing is taking a bunch of medium to small size sections and trimming my hair. So the first thing that you're going to have to do is make sure you have a comb and make sure your hair is either blow dried or straightened. I like to do it on blow dried or straightened hair because it is really important when you trim your hair that your hair is at its full length so that you can really see the ends and you can really see where you need to cut so as you guys can see I will run through it with a comb after I run through it with a comb I will pull my fingers down the section and I will look at the ends and if you see that your hair is in all sorts of directions you will definitely need to trim that section also recommend that you guys use a fine tooth comb when you are detangling your hair when you are about to trim it because fine tooth combs do a great job of detangling your hair and making sure there are no knots don't use a wide tooth comb as it won't be as effective so definitely use a fine tooth comb so you can really detangle your hair and it can really help you see where your split ends are also throughout this video you guys will see me compare my hair multiple times I will take two sections and I'll put them next to each other and compare to see if they are still the same length and that is really really important that you do that because you do not want to chop your hair or trim your hair in random lengths that won't be good and it won't look good so it's really really important that you trim almost the same amount off for each section my hair in the back is pretty much the exact same length so it is really really important that you make sure you keep that same length throughout and one side of your hair is not longer than the other.
last thing that I'm going to do for this section is I'm going to pull at the ends a little bit and just add a little more shape to the ends of my hair. And pretty much I'm going to do the exact same process that I did on the other side to this side of my hair. that I like to do is I like to add an oil to my hair after I trim it. I did not have any more castor oil so I just had to use what I had and I just had this revival oil and it's a very light oil but I usually like to use a very thick oil after I trim my hair but this just had to do for today and I'm just going to use it on each side of my head and just really focus it on the ends. And that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a comment down below and let me know if you've ever trimmed your hair yourself. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. Don't forget to turn on my post notification bell to get notified every single time I post. I post two times a week on Tuesdays and Fridays, so you don't wanna miss a video. Also, don't forget to like this video, leave down any video suggestions you may have down below. Follow my Instagram my snapchat my twitter and my tiktok to keep up with me and i will see you all in my next video bye